today we're creating the biochar. Tomorrow we're going to inoculate the biochar with all kinds of my um, beneficial microbes for the soil. Here at Orca Song Farm uh, on Orcas Island in the San Juan Islands, making some biochar today. And we're using um, old tractor fuel and home heating oil tanks that were on property. By cutting off the tops of the tanks, we converted these tanks to open cylinder biochar burn tanks. So we build it like a, it's like a lasagna layer. And when it gets charred and, and a little ashy, then we add the new layer of wood uh, and we build that up so we keep the flame on top. Uh, and at the end, when the wood is all the way to the top of the cylinder, and then we arrest the burn, either with water or with a lid in this case. Um, and then we'll let it, with a lid, we'll let it sit for 36 hours and then we'll dump it out and have a huge uh, cylinder of uh, ready, to, ready to go biochar. We have 45 acres of forest here. It needs a lot of management, thinning and culling. And we're using that material to create char, which then we can then inoculate, put it in the soil, build the nutrient uh, profile of that soil so that we get more nutrient dense vegetables, more nutrient dense fruits. So this is what we just made. Just beautiful, crunchy, nice biochar. You can see all the surface area in there for beneficial microbes and bacteria to inhabit in the soil. We're going to use it in our huge garden space, which is a market garden, uh, CSA garden, community garden, uh, supplies a good amount of food to all kinds of um, stores and restaurants and direct to consumers here on the island. And this is sequestering carbon in the soil for you know hundreds, if not thousands of years. Um, and this is all readily available to us on the property here and all over the island. So anywhere there's a lot of biomass, forest biomass, thinning, culling, cutting, managing, this is available to us. Together as a neighborhood, we can uh, cooperate to maybe share these burners. They may move around the island, move around the neighborhood, and we go help each other create biochar. Uh, and that can be for forest restoration, can be for pasture restoration, can be for people's gardens. Anywhere there's lots of forest, people are maybe managing their forest, but then creating slash piles and just burning it. Um, just to get rid of it. Anywhere there's a lot of biomass, we can create another highly valuable product from it instead. We're sequestering that carbon back into the earth. This summer has seen some record-breaking heat. Their heat indices already up to 104 at the nation's capital. You need those One air conditioners as you travel across 101 record-setting degrees. In July, many people headed out of the cities looking for relief at the ocean. Hi, Dad. And in the mountains. 